Well, it's been a real pleasure to welcome some of Western Australia's elite cyclists here to the West Australian Parliament. We're lucky to have wonderful young people who are road riders, uh, they are BMX and mountain bikers, fantastic young cyclists representing Western Australia at the elite international level. Uh, my name's Rachel Gaskin. I'm a BMX racer from Perth, Western Australia. Hey, my name's Joe Henley and I race for Team Sunweb. So my name's Ben O'Connor and I race for Team Dimension Data for Quebec. Uh, my name is Jessica Allen. I'm 25 years old and I'm from Perth, Western Australia. I ride for a uh, World Tour team called Mitchelton Scott. Uh, probably the highlight of the year was going to China to race uh, a UCI international race in uh, September. Yeah, that was a big one. Um, really good to get some international experience. Yeah. Yeah, it's been really nice. Uh, so it was my first year as a professional and yeah, I've just been living in Europe for the past 10 months, uh, racing my bike and yeah, living the dream basically. So. Yeah, overall, the whole year, unreal. <laughs> Yeah, last 12 months has been really good for me. Um, I've been living in a place called Varese in Italy. Uh, so I went back there in February this year and raced the World Tour and this was my most successful year on the bike and also the team's most successful year. So I'm um, re really looking forward to 2019 now. It's good to, good to be noticed as a pretty small sport in terms of cycling. Yeah, it's great to be recognised as a as a whole and um, with the other cycling disciplines as well. Yeah, I think it's pretty important. Um, yeah, cycling is actually pretty popular in Perth and a lot of people ride the bike. So yeah, for cyclists to be recognised, I think it's a pretty nice thing. It's kind of, it's humbling because I haven't had recognition before. I've never been in a kind of a status or even a level where I've been able to be recognised yeah, this is the first time I've been recognised by Parliament um, for yeah being a professional cyclist and coming here, having a morning tea uh, and welcoming us back from Europe, I think is really special. Um, we're kind of limited here in WA in terms of facilities. Uh, over east, they uh, all kind of have a big facility with an eight metre ramp and yeah, we lack that here in WA, so training's a bit hard sometimes and we're spending a lot of time travelling over east, so that would be probably the biggest thing for us as elite riders, yeah. I think it'd just be that everyone just cooperates well on the road and everyone just looks after each other, because at the end of the day we've all got to go back back to families or, you know, back back to homes and, yeah, everyone's, everyone's as important as each other, so. I think as you said before with the recognition, I think it's just recognising not actually us as pro riders, but everyone else as riders on the road. I would love to ask the government to keep improving road safety um, on the road for cyclists, better bike paths, um, you know, being really strict with helmet laws. I think that's a huge factor. Um, and also road safety with cars. We have the metre rule, which is fantastic, but to keep pushing that, try and get some road safety signs out a bit more just to remind people that they have to give us the distance. Um, and yeah, just to make sure there's less, um, less deaths and, and accidents out on the road by cyclists. Uh, we love cycling for recreation. Uh, as a transport option, commuting into Parliament quite often as I do, it's a great way to get around. And of course, it's an activity that is wonderful for the health benefits as well. So I'm very Absolutely. pleased the Deputy Premier Health Minister is here as well. Hi, Roger. Hi, Chris. Thank you very much for having us here today. This is a great celebration of cycling. And as you say, cycling not only benefits people from the fact that they can commute, they can, they can uh, be actively involved in competitive sport, but it's also simply a terrific way to live an active, healthy life.